Cooking seafood doesn't have to be scary. It's really just all about preparation, timing, and a little know-how. And I'm going to show you. When it comes to making seafood, you have to keep in mind two things. You have to have an understanding of the type of seafood you're working with, and you have to understand that 60 seconds can be a lifetime. So knowing when to stop cooking can make or break your dish. Today, I'm going to go over a few methods on how to prepare your seafood, but first, I'm going to let you guys in on a little chef's secret on how to season your fish that will not only give you a better texture, but also double its flavor. Now it's always best to start with the basics. So the first technique I'm gonna show you is grilling. technique I'm going to show you is called empapiol or cooking in a packet and is the perfect blend of practicality and theater that's going to give your dish a real wow factor at the dinner table. Teriyaki is actually a cooking technique, and it is the process of cooking something in a glaze. And I can't think of any seafood better to teriyaki than shrimp.
things to do with seafood is to pair them with stuffing. Now, stuffed fish gives you a great opportunity to introduce textures and flavors that you wouldn't be able to achieve through just grilling alone. I like best about seafood is that it could be filling but still be light all at the same time. And one of the best and most unique ways to achieve this is with a terrine. And this dish is absolutely stunning. many other ways to prepare seafood, but that's all I have time for in part one. So if you enjoyed this week's episode, please feel free to give that like button some love and subscribe. And if you enjoyed the show, please feel free to share it as it does help this channel grow immensely. 
If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please leave them in the comments section down below. I would love to read them. Recipes are down in the description boxes. My name is Chef Matt with Kitchen Instruments, and I'll see you guys next time.